What's up you beautiful people? Thank you once again for tuning in to my channel. I'm Sadiq. Today we're going to be talking and discussing how this $30 wireless earbuds from MPOW and I believe it's called the S10 Pro fares against the $300 wireless earbuds from Sony which is the WF-1000XM3. So we did a video a few weeks ago on these pair of earbuds from Sony, the Sony 1000 XM3 a few weeks ago. So if you haven't checked that video out, make sure to click the link here to check out our review and see in details how our experience has been like with this pair of earbuds. So before we start, I would like to request for an early thumbs up to help with the YouTube algorithm. If this is your first time tuning into the channel, make sure to subscribe to our channel to join the community and hit that notification button so you can stay tuned for upcoming contents. So as we talked about this pair of earbuds on our other review, these pair of earbuds are simply fantastic for audio and music. What it lacks is that it currently does not have any waterproof rating, so you really can't work out with them or you can really even go out on running with them because you don't know how the moisture would react and you definitely don't want to ruin your $300 pair of Sony earbuds. So this is where the MPOW S10 Pro comes in. I was looking for something which is not relatively expensive, which is obviously waterproof so I can take it out for a run or use it during working out. And at the same time, once again, I don't want to spend that much money again on a pair of wireless earbuds. So when I was searching for something on Amazon, this popped out and it was pretty highly recommended. I will leave the link in the description below. So if you guys want to check it out and you want to order a pair of these pair of earbuds, you can do so as well. So right out of the box, it comes with the wireless pair of earbuds, the carrying case, the charging cable, a manual, as well as a charging cable and extra earphones for your wireless earbuds. So right out of the box, it's very easy to use. All you have to do is pretty much press the button on on the wireless earbuds and make sure you on your device, you're looking for the wireless earbuds and you can connect it to the MPOW S10. What I really like about this wireless earbuds is that it also comes with a voice notification which lets you know every time you turn on your wireless earbuds as well as every time it connects to a device, which I feel for a $30 pair of earbuds is a pretty cool and nifty feature. So one thing I have to say about the fit and finish of this earbuds is pretty good. When I go out and I'm wearing this, it actually feels it's fairly secured in my ear. So if you're going for a run or going for a walk, you'll feel comfortable where you don't have to look and make sure that it's in your ear. Unlike Sony, which I think every time I was walking around, I had to be very, very careful sometimes just to make sure it doesn't fall off. So in terms of audio quality and call quality on this pair of wireless earbuds, house is pretty decent. For most people, I think that's gonna be pretty adequate. It doesn't have any active noise cancellation at this point. Uh, however, I think with the great seal, you, it does a really good job in keeping the noises away and has a really good seal. The earbuds actually can connect to two devices at the same time. So you can connect your computer and also your phone at the same time, which I feel is a really cool feature. And I think all the wireless earbuds should have it. If a $30 pair of earbuds can have this feature, I don't see why any other earbuds shouldn't have this feature at this point. Another great party trick for this pair of earbuds is this magnet, which makes sure when you put it around, it just locks in and it's secured around your neck. So if you're going for a walk or run at the same time, if you're tired of listening to your music, you don't have to put it away. You can simply just put the magnets together and it's just secured around your neck. Pretty cool feature. In terms of battery life, I think this pair of earbuds actually has pretty decent battery life. I used it over days, sometimes for hours, and then just left it in and picked it back up on again the next day and just kept on listening without charging it and it just did fine. Out of the box, it says that it has around 400 hours of standby time and somewhere around 12 to 14 hours of active listening time, which is actually pretty great for a pair of earbuds. So now some of the things I didn't like about the MPOW S10 Pro or things I think Sony actually does better. 
First of all, I think Sony simply has a superior audio quality. If you, it's just an experience, if you're listening to audio or taking a call or music on Sony, just the way it's built is just simply fantastic. Sony actually has an active noise cancellation and ambient noise feature. So if you're going out for a walk with the earbuds on, if you can be very aware of your surrounding, which I feel is actually really cool, especially if you're walking around um, like a sidewalk and you're just going for a walk, it just makes sure you can be aware of your oncoming traffic or anybody coming from the back and be aware of your surrounding, which is simply amazing. And that's not something the MPOW S10 have at this point. Uh, I know it's $30 uh, of earbuds, so you can, I wasn't really expecting it. It's just some feature that Sony has, which MPOW unfortunately at this point doesn't have. Another thing I found out with the MPOW S10 Pro is at times it has choppy Bluetooth connection. Um, I had some issues with the Sony earbuds as well. It could be my computer, but I found out it's increasingly noticeable with the MPOW S10 Pro, uh, whereas the Sony's earbuds, it was just occasional issues that I faced with the Bluetooth connection. So just something that keep in mind. Uh, let me know in the comment section below if how is your experience been like with the S10 Pro, if you had any Bluetooth issues or not, uh, what can be some of the fixes? I would definitely like to figure out from you. So in the end, does this mean the S10 Pro will be replacing my Sony's earbuds? And the answer is no, and here's why. Even though Sony's earbuds does not have a proper waterproof rating, and at times it doesn't have a secured fit, one thing it does have, and it does amazingly well, is the audio quality that it has, and it's simply fantastic. I think Sony's earbuds at any point, price point, has the best audio quality if you're looking into the market for a new pair of earbuds. However, if you're looking for something that has all the features um, that Sony does, apart from the noise cancellation, along with tons of other features, and you don't want to break your bank, you want to have, want something that you can use it for your work, you can use it for your working out, going out in the world, look no further. I think S10 Pro probably is it, and you can't really beat it at a $30 price point. So until next time, take excellent care of yourself, love and respect each other just like the way you like to be loved and respected. Until next time, guys, take care. Love you. Bye.